and welcome back to Crash Bandicoot 3. We're going straight into Midnight Run. For part 3. Why? Why must you continue to be a thorn in our side? What? Where was I? Oh, Tiny was a good fellow. He hated everyone and everything, but a good heart nonetheless. Please be more reasonable with my minions next time. Do as in my face. I want to hear it, Cortex. You caused me enough trouble. In the past. Okay. Now, for Midnight Run, it's just like Orient Express. Except it's supposed to be a little bit harder. And... I'm going to take my time. Instead of trying to run through it. I repeat, I guess these levels must be my curse levels when it comes to recording. Because when I played this when I wasn't recording, this wasn't a problem. This is an on camera curse. So, are we running in the blank spots that I can? Don't hit that. I missed that. Okay, it's gonna be like that. I'm gonna call this the pure curse. Man, if I ever play CTR, I am never playing this pure. Okay, got it this time. Can I get this box? Okay, I got that box. Okay, so we got still got these dragons. We got these dudes carrying things. Okay. Normally, I jump over, like run, jump over those guys. I ain't risk it this time. I'm gonna kind be quiet during this level because Jesus is level. It seems to me the pure level seem to just mess me up terribly. See what I mean? I mean, thankfully, I'm not that far back. I don't think I have to do that extremely, like, three bog of jump again, though. No, I don't. Okay, good. I don't. I don't wanna... You can break through those. If you just charge at them, you can break them. Okay. I missed. I just wasted that life. We don't miss boxes around these parts. Okay. It's not so bad. It could be worse. It could end up like last time. I get to the end and realize I missed a box. I kind of won't end up that way. This is a crystal right here. The crystal's right at the end of the level. It's right at the end of the level. So This time we got this level, no, not really much of a problem. So. Hopefully, the relic race shouldn't be that much of a problem for that. We got midnight run out the way. It's up longer than it should have, but very safe and sorry. So we'll go in the road. We'll go in the road hog next. This is the first of the like few motorcycle levels that we have. Now there's no crystal in the track. You have to win the race. And there's a gem still, so you have to get all the boxes. Usually these levels are very low on boxes, and this one only has 13 boxes. So. Hopefully, I'll get the gem and I'll win the race at the same time. That's the best scenario. Step, if, you, if you swirl on the road, you lose a lot of time. And you jump ramps, you kind of lose a lot of time. So I have to because there's boxes. I don't like missing boxes. 
I can't really avoid this. I'm in fourth. Okay, I got 13 boxes. Small little skip that I just took. Let's see if I can ride, let's see if I can ride this to victory. I should be able to, yeah, I will. I got this race one. And I got the jump. next. <clears throat> Let's see. Okay, now, for G-Wiz, it's just like um, Toad Village, except a lot longer. A lot more things to worry about. You get new things. You get these boxes. You can't spin them. So, you have to use... The thing is, I'm pretty sure the normal body slam breaks those two. But you don't get them introduced to this, so I'm assuming you might. Okay. These guys are. They're easy to kill, but they're annoying nonetheless. There's a lot of nitros around here. Ah, oh, I lost a mask so early. <laughs> Excuse me, Jesus. Ooh. This level is very, rather simple. And, uh, down, there's, a, there's a one up on those boxes. There's another one up. I doubt I'm gonna grab it though. I got it. I got the one up. Okay, cool. This this game lives are nowhere near a problem. I remember them used to being a problem when I first played as a kid, but other than that, now I do not remember this being that bad. I do not. This is pretty easy. So. Oh, whoa, I thought that was gonna blow up the nitro. I, I wish it would have actually saved me some time. It blew up. Oh no, no, no. Just avoid those. See how, like, if you just get fruit, you just. You win. Okay, I kill a nitro. Oops, and I completely killed myself in a bonus level. And all that nice fruit wasted. All that nice fruit. Probably the, this will be the last level I do for this part. Let's see. We'll get all our. There, we'll run into our first colored gem in this area, but we won't be able to get it just yet. You'll be able to see it in the level though, but you won't be able to get it unless you cheat. But there's a cheat way to get it, but I'm not gonna cheat to get it. I don't feel like it's necessary just to get a colored gem. You 
kind of, you have to jump. You have to do that, like, jump to get it. This makes the rest of the stairs, so you can get up here. But it seals off that, that crate down there, so you kind of need it. I want that. Every little bit matters. So 18 to 18 boxes, 133 fruit, so we're guaranteed to actually like it. So that's nice. That counter is still going. It'll be going. It's over like now though. So. That was a lot of fruit. Yeah, I don't want him swinging that sword again. Okay, we got 87 out of 100. It's like, where are the other nitros counted boxes, obviously? So. 100. So. You hit the little green box at the end of the level, it breaks all the nitros for you. So, that's a cheap whiz. We'll complete this world in the boss next time.